Crimped wire mesh and woven wire mesh? Doesn't weaving wire mesh make it crimped? Why would I pre-crimp it? I'll explain everything you need to know, so stick around. Hey there, what's up? My name's Andrew Kotlar, and wire mesh stands out as one of the most widely used screening materials. Crimp wire mesh and woven wire mesh are two wire mesh variants that each deliver unique benefits that make them ideal for specific applications. But which one makes more sense for my operation? Well, WS Tyler has been dedicated to customer-centric woven wire innovations for over 150 years, and we strive to provide you with a comprehensive understanding of what wire mesh solution makes the most sense for your operation. So in this video, we'll go over what crimp wire mesh is, what woven wire mesh is, how crimp wire mesh and woven wire mesh compare, and which wire mesh variant is best for you. Crimped wire mesh is a woven wire variant where the individual wires of a weave are pre-crimped prior to the weaving process. Pre-crimping involves bending the wires in a consistent, uniform zigzag pattern. Crimped wire mesh can be found in alloys like stainless steel, aluminum, copper, brass, and much more. Also, crimped wires can be used to form various weave profiles like plain weave, intermediate crimps, and flat top crimps. Woven wire mesh is a metallic fabric constructed from hundreds of individual wires that are interwoven in an over-under pattern during a precise centuries-old weaving process. This leaves the wire mesh interlaced at right angles, creating pore openings that are rigid and uniform. What makes woven wire mesh such a widely used material is the fact that virtually every parameter of the mesh can be tailored to your exact needs. This includes wire diameter, weave pattern, alloy, and mesh count. So they may look similar, but crimped wire mesh and woven wire mesh have several manufacturing and structural differences. Looking at how it's made, pre-crimped wire mesh requires a pre-crimped process that physically bends and alters the profile of those individual wires. Pre-crimping creates a more stable and rigid weave where the wires are held in place better. These crimps create a textured surface, but at the same time, it helps maintain the shape of the mesh as well as the space of the openings. That said, the crimped wire mesh renders the material more suitable for heavy duty applications that subject the mesh to high levels of mechanical stress. Woven wire, on the other hand, interlaces the wires of the weave at right angles and does not require that the wires be processed before the weaving process. The lack of crimping often results in a smoother surface. While not as rigid, woven wire mesh is considerably more flexible and easier to form, but the flexibility is also heavily influenced by the wire diameter and weave pattern. So it's all dependent on your application, but applications that require stronger, more robust weave should rely on crimp wire mesh. And applications that require fine precision and increased flexibility should use woven wire mesh. With its superior rigidity, crimped wire mesh is more likely to be used for screening in the mining, construction, and other heavy duty industries. But since it's more flexible and usually delivers finer specifications, woven wire mesh is typically seen in filtration and sieving applications. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, fill out a contact us form so we can answer your specific questions. Just click the link in the description. And if you'd like to learn more about Woven Wire Mesh or our many products, we have a learning center filled with written and video content to make you an expert. Just click that second link and you'll be that expert in new tech. And don't forget to click that subscribe button and ring that bell to keep up with all things WS Tyler. Once again, my name's Andrew Kotlar and I'll see you around in the next video. Bye for now.